what about you probably just um like wanting to watch netflix just watching netflix was your passion oh you'll be you'll be blown away you'll be surprised though frankly speaking right one of my i am i'm a avid watcher since i was uh nine years old i watched a lot of drama with my amma when i want when my mom forced me to study and somehow somewhat right it wired me to understand emotions so damn well okay and right now my passion right is hearing stories from people bloody hell that's my passion that that explains this business by the way i'm the i'm in the business of listening to stories how many of you agree god damn that was triggered when i was eight years old man you see how the how beautiful this thing is mm-hmm. just see okay. what you spend your most time at that's your natural gift and my mom was calling me stupid son so you should study then i'm like oh okay okay but end up my eyes was fixated on the, on the screen and i see when the person cry how come i'm crying i'm like oh that's a newfound awareness that my, my dad called me a girl when i cry you see, you see so so it took me some time when i do the map i changed the word emotional to empathetic and i do the past present future thing last time i love to watch drama why because i love listening to stories i love people's stories they are real cool so i combine my strength that i'm empathetic that i'm a good listener right that i can i'm a good teacher plus uh maybe i can i can coach well boom this business was formed that is what i want you guys to go and explore combine your aoi you see different kind of uh, strength right combine what can you merge so if i may help jaceline a little bit jaceline's strength is that she's very in my gyms take care okay jaceline's strength right is that she has many different perspectives at the same time she's very empathetic for me it's very for me i have my own limiting belief that i might not be as logical or strategic as i should be i'm more towards the feeling emotional side of things but for her i can see a very nice marriage between both what she can do is probably start up a YouTube channel to talk about topics that she's cared, she care about, articulating her emotion about it, her logic side of things as well. She can capture both market. That could be interesting. It trains, don't care, I'm not talking about a YouTube subscriber, no. Nope. I'm talking about train her strength. Because for now, she might be doing that thing for fun, just to improve. But one day, you never know, a news reporter will come. And ask her, would you want a, a, a news company or whatever, broadcasting or media company, would you want to come and hire, uh, uh, work for me? Then you're like, huh? I'm just a little kid doing my own thing. But no, they saw strength in her because she saw, she subconsciously saw strength in herself to begin with. That is what I want AOI to give you guys. How you can combine all different things and create a mini passion project. 